Hello friends. So, what is a heart wall? A heart wall is an energetic wall around our hearts that prevents us from being in a state of feeling love and union with people around us and having compassion for their issues and problems and understanding what they're going through and at the same time having that compassion for ourselves as well. I remember I had a keychain that my uh, from the spiritual path I'm on it said love all and I always used to wonder what does that feel like? What does love all feel like? And then one day I came across a practitioner who told me about my heart wall and she said you wouldn't know love if it hit you in the face <laughs> so she said you need to clear out the heart wall first because it's a it's a it's a combination of various defenses that we put around ourselves you know so you may have a bad experience in your life and you say oh i'm never going to let that happen to me again and so you have a little bit of reaction to criticism you have a little bit of uh, defensiveness so there may be an edge in your voice when you speak to people there may be something and it turns them off and um, the connection doesn't take off and it can happen like that with people in a grocery store or in, a, in a bank it can happen in any kind of situation so how do you feel this love for all of mankind how, how do you go from the place where you're reacting to people inside even if you don't express it outside uh, to where you honestly feel a connection, you know, with the world around you. It starts with clearing the heart wall. So with applied kinesiology, we muscle, we muscle test and see how big the heart wall is first. Mine was 50 feet. And I'd like to share with you that uh, I was so excited about this work that the day the practitioner introduced this to me, I was like, wow, I don't want to wait another week for another session. I want to just finish it up myself. So luckily I was an applied kinesiologist and I was able to just do it on my own. So I did one session with her, I did the hour, and then I continued on my own the same day. And I finished clearing the whole 50 feet on my own that very same day. Oh my God, the difference I felt was just so incredibly awesome. Um, it happened to be the 21st uh, day, 21st year of um, my spiritual birthday and that day when I met my spiritual teacher and I got some prashad which is blessed food and I shared it with the congregation, it was just so amazing. It was like everyone was noticing uh, a glowing energy and people were saying it looks so good today. and people I never talked to were talking to me, people I'd had conflict with, deep conflict, were talking to me as if nothing had happened and saying, you're looking so wonderful. It was as if I was wearing rosy glasses and I was, people were seeing me differently and I was seeing them differently. It was a life transforming experience and I'm sorry that it took me so long and to get to a point where I could feel that. Now that doesn't mean I don't have reactions to situations and things I do. Subsequently, I found out I also had a hidden heart wall and then I worked on clearing out my hidden heart wall. But I had prayed for so long to be able to understand what does this love all feel like? And Divine Grace sent me an answer through helping me clear my heart wall. So I hope you'll give yourself that opportunity to just see what it feels like. It's just awesome. It can be muscle tested how big the heart wall is and emotion by emotion, negative emotion by negative emotion. You clear it out one by one by one. Some of it is your own, some of it is ancestral. We can check that as we go along. You can also see at what age you felt that particular emotion. And it helps you to have compassion for yourself. And it helps you to understand why you have been the way you have been. And as you start loving and understanding yourself more, you'll begin to love and understand other people too, because just the way you react, so do they.
and it puts you in a better place um, to have better connections with people. So that was my story and I will share with you some stories of my clients in the videos to come. And uh, I hope you've enjoyed this one. I look forward to seeing you in the next video and in the workshop to come.